This is a guide on replacing a glass touch screen and an LCD on the Apple iPhone 6S Plus. To begin, turn off the phone by holding the power button on the side and confirming the shutdown on screen. Remove two screws with a pantalope screwdriver, one on each side of the docking connector. Set the screws aside. Place a suction cup as close to the home button as possible without overlapping it. Pull on the suction cup while opening the phone from the bottom edge. Insert a plastic pick in the gap between the front assembly and the main body. Gently move the plastic pick around the perimeter of the device. Proceed on opening the phone from the bottom edge. You may need to cut several strands of glue between the front assembly and the main body during separation. Open the iPhone as a clamshell to a right angle. For a safe reinstallation process, the battery has to be disconnected. The battery connector is located under a small metal shield. Remove two Phillips screws securing the shield. Remove the shield. Disconnect the battery. In order to separate the front assembly, we need to gain access to its connectors under an EM shield. Remove five Phillips screws holding the shield in place. Remove the shield. Use a plastic pick to open the three connectors. Be very careful since the connectors are extremely fragile. Separate the front assembly from the main body and place it on the desk. Take the replacement part and lay it down beside the old one. As you can see, the new front assembly is missing some of the components. The home button, big metal shield, front camera with sensors, and the earpiece. All of these working parts have to be transferred from the old front assembly onto the new one. Start with the home button. Remove two Phillips screws holding the metal bracket over the home button and remove the bracket. Next step is to remove the big metal shield. Remove three Phillips screws on the right side of the assembly, one screw on the top, and three more screws on the left side. Remove the shield. Using a flat screwdriver, open the home button connector. Using a plastic pick, begin separating the home button from the frame. Push on it from the front of the assembly, making sure that the rubber membrane stays with the button. Set it aside. Proceed on removing the metal shield, which holds the earpiece and the camera with sensors. Remove three Phillips screws. Remove the shield. The front camera is on the same garland of cables as all the sensors. Gently pull the camera on its cable away from the frame and remove the earpiece. Using tweezers, carefully separate the entire garland. It is glued on in several spots. Set it aside. Take the new front assembly and remove the protective film. Begin attaching the front camera with all the cables and sensors. Guide each component into its place. Replace the earpiece and insert the camera into its placeholder. Replace the metal shield over top and secure it with three Phillips screws. Next, replace the home button. Make sure that it is aligned properly and close the home button connector. Position the big metal shield onto the new front assembly, aligning it to the screw placements. Make sure that the digitizer flap goes under the shield. Replace one screw at the top, three screws on the right, and three more screws on the left. Replace the metal bracket over the home button and secure it with two Phillips screws. At this point, we can reconnect the new front assembly to the main body. Align it with the top edge at a right angle and begin reconnecting it. Snap in the three connectors one by one. The connectors will make a distinct click when closed properly. Connectors are extremely fragile. Make sure to align them properly and do not apply too much force. Now we can test the iPhone. Reconnect the battery and turn the phone on. If the startup graphics appear, the part is installed properly. Turn the phone off and finish the reinstallation process. Replace the metal shield over the battery connector. Secure it with two Phillips screws. 
replace the EM shield and secure it with 5 screws. Now we can close the phone. Insert the top edge of the front assembly into the groove and then pressing on the side snap the rest of the assembly back in place. Replace two pentalobe screws at the bottom. Turn the iPhone on, remove the protective film, and we're done.